In line with the tradition of the House, the Majority Leader Ferguson moved the motion for the suspension of the House relevant rules to welcome Governor Fayonkoa for his proposed budget presentation, which was seconded by member representing Sapele State Constituency, Felix Anura. The Speaker, Sheriff Oboyewari thereafter welcomed the Governor and his entourage to the House. The House Chamber of the Delta State Assembly for the presentation of the uh, 2022 budget. Governor Kowa reviewed his 2021 budget of 378.1 billion naira performance. Construction of nine technical colleges, uh, South of Bell, Rural Bell, Ubi, Iri, Omagina, Tupena, Waliro, and Street Advanced Stage. When completed, they will bring the total number of technical schools in the state to 15. Governor Ifa Yokoa thereafter presented the 2022 budget proposal of 469 billion 495 million 968,075 naira to execute projects and programs. The total projected recurrent expenditure of 185.357 billion for 2022 is proposed to be spent to meet the government's financial obligations on salaries, wages, debt repayment and the day-to-day -day running of ministry departments and agencies of government. The governor said infrastructure, health, education, skills acquisition programs top allocation of the 2022 budget proposal. The 2022 budget will be funded from the regular revenue sources including opening balance from the previous year. Staff free allocation, 13% oil mineral fund, Taxes and non tax revenues such as fees, fines, permits, rents, interest, dividends, and licenses. Other revenue sources include grants and domestic credits. The House received the budget proposal after a motion moved by the majority leader and seconded by member representing Etup West, Mrs. Irita K. Boris Swenum. Aye. Aye. The House, however, fixed 26 October 2021 for second reading from Asaba, Austin Azu reporting.